What is up everybody, it's your boy Nate coming at you with another quick Pokemon TCG card opening. Today I am pleased to present In the Blue Corner, featuring the Rapid Strike Urshifru V and the Rapid Strike Reverse Energy Urshifru. And in the red corner, featuring Single Strike Urshifru V and the Single Strike Reverse Energy Urshifru again! <sighs> the crowd goes wild. The um, two brand new Urshifru V-Box collections fe featuring single and rapid strike. Urshifru in blue and red. These uh, retail in the US for 20 US dollars and um, the contents are more or less the same however the promos are different. Even though they are both Urshifru, one features the Urshifru V Rapid and the other features features the single strike edition so two different cards both black star promos want to get into these open them up and see what we've got be calm and flow like water with rapid strike urshifru v sweet little cub Fu has grown wise and dangerous trained in the tower of waters and now commands ultimate speed and accuracy as rapid strike urshifru v this pokemon v watches for the perfect moment striking again and again enhance your collection with this martial arts pokemon and then, sweet little Kubfu has grown wise and dangerous, trained in the Tower of Darkness, and now commands extraordinary power as Single Strike Urshifru V. This Pokemon infuses its attacks with all its power to deliver one mighty blow and knock aside all opposition. Very cool, very cool. I hope you guys enjoyed that little, that little take there. So I'm going to pop these bad boys open, get the promos out so we can kind of compare the two versions of the card, and uh, see what we've got. So, first things first, I'm the realist. No, single strike. Let's get in here. It's always impossible to open these bad boys. Boop. Boop. Please recycle. All right. Here is the single strike Urshifru V in all its glory. He's coming at you with a strong mitt there. Low knuckle 30. And then brawny knuckle. This attack's damage isn't affected by resistance. That's pretty dope. Though I don't know how many Pokemon are resistant to fighting type that are very common in the TCG right now. But that doesn't mean that there aren't any. And then here is the jumbo card, which will fit nicely into that new... 25th anniversary Pikachu binder that I've got here. Very cool. Centering on this card is atrocious. You can really tell on these jumbo <laughs> cards. Um, <laughs> ooh, good thing it's not that big of a deal. And then a couple of packs here. Two battle styles. A Darkness of Blaze, which is pretty sweet, and a Crimson Invasion. I'm actually going to up the ante here and replace the Darkness of Blaze and Crimson Invasion with two more battle styles packs just to kind of make it that much more exciting with the card opening. The pack selection overall for this um, collection, um, from what I've seen, what I have seen, it, it's okay. It's not that great. I think you can get Darkness of Blaze and Vivid Voltage in these. Uh, and our, both those sets are good. Both of them are very good, actually. But uh, I'm seeing a lot of Sun and Moon and Crimson Invasion, uh, Sun and Moon base, that is, in these. Um, and I think you're going to be seeing a lot of Sun and Moon base uh, going forward. I think they've more or less stopped putting um, XY packs in things. Um, so no more sweet extra evolutions packs, um, unfortunately. Which is, I mean, you got to move on sometime, right? Um, here is that Rapid Strike energy. Which I really like these energies because they have the, uh, like, even the... Even the energy symbol up here is just kind of like hollow and reverse, so that's very cool. And then the Rapid Strike Urshifru. Spiral Kick does 40. Sonic Legs, this attack also does 20 damage to two of your opponent's bench Pokemon. So that's kind of nice. A little, like a different style of attacking. And then here comes the Jumbo card for your viewing pleasure as well. So that's very, very cool. I'll go ahead and put that bad boy up right there. Pack selection for this one is Battle Styles, Darkness Ablaze, Battle Styles, and Crimson Invasion. So there was not a difference in mine, um, but uh, some some might be a little bit different. 
So let's go ahead. We'll replace those two. And uh, we'll see what we can get. Eight packs of battle styles. I've been actually having some pretty good luck with the set so far, I feel like. Quite a few VMAX pulls. Um, a full art in my latest opening, which is always cool. I'm um, anxious to see what the pulls are going to be like from this today. Um, if you are picking up these sets, um, I guess part of my reason for making the video is just to kind of show you, the viewer, that uh, there isn't much of a difference between the two collections, Cedra, Esper, um, besides just that promo card, what your, uh, you know, maybe your preference for single stripe, rapid, rapid strike, Pignite reverse into a victory bell for our regular rare. Um, maybe you're starting a new deck of one or the other and you really want to get an Urshifru in there. So maybe you pick up uh, a couple single strike and maybe you don't take the rapid, rapid strike or vice versa. You know, that all makes sense. So it's a good way to get an Urshifru in your deck if you're trying to build a particular style. Um, Psychic Energy, Glysaur, Bruno, Rapid Style Mustard, Pachurisu, Mindfu, Baltoy, Larian Mr. Rhyme, Fomantis, Sworded, and Shieldbert, who are two of the lamest, dullest, stupidest, I don't know, just so many words to describe how much I dislike these two guys as like antagonists in the end game of Sword and Shield into a Entei Hollow Rare. Fantastic. That's a cool pull. You may attach a fire energy card from your hand to this Pokemon. Your opponent's active Pokemon is now burned for the other attack. Very, very cool for those uh for those guys loving their fire decks. Alright, two packs in, two heaters. Alright, let's go. See if we can keep some of this luck going. Oh, fighting, Luxio, Durant, Purgly, Bellsprout, Onyx, Spiro, Sizzlepeep, Shinx, Mankey single strike into a Lorantis for our rare. So I did want to kind of like switch out. Sometimes, um, sometimes with these collections, these twenty dollar collections, you do get some really cool older sets. Um, this one, this set, this one in particular. I mean, Darkness Plays I think is a really cool set. I'm actually kind of trying a new thing, newer thing with my videos, where I kind of keep, try to keep the sets together. Makes it easier for um, people who are searching for, I guess, specific openings, right? Um, but I could see how maybe it'd be annoying if you're like, oh, I want to see what the pulls are from those. But uh, don't wait, don't worry. We'll uh, we'll get to those. Reverse rare Houndoom, fantastic. Into a Jellicent for our regular rare. Um, yeah, don't worry. We'll we'll get into those as we move into our fourth, ooh, fifth pack, fifth pack. Ooh, white code card. If you guys haven't noticed, the white and green code cards are back and probably here to stay. Um, it was kind of nice with Shining Fates and even, I guess, Dark um, uh, Champion's Path to have just like the all white code cards. Um, so you just, I don't know, kept the kept the excitement going a little bit longer. Taypig, Glysaur into a Luxray for our holographic rare. I don't know, I kept it, I kept the suspense going a little bit longer, especially if you're doing the card trick. If you're just cracking packs and going through them at a, you know, at a rapid pace, see what I did there? Then, uh, uh, you know, maybe it doesn't matter to you. Um, but for me, when I'm doing it this way, I kind of like to, like to, I don't, I don't like to know right away. I like to kind of be surprised. Scroll of Scorn, this sharp, Bronzor. So I do try to hide the code cards whenever I can, but it's not always easy to do. Spoopa for the reverse into a meow stick. Wow, I like the hollow pattern on there. Ear moves. Once during your turn, you may move one damage counter from one of your Pokemon to your opponent's Pokemon. Very neat for our reverse rare. So we've gotten it's our third 
third hollow hit so far, so not bad. Not bad at all. Ooh. See if we can up the ante a little bit with a little bit of a juicier card here or there. We've got a fire energy, single strike. Camping gear, search your deck for a card and put it into your hand. Very cool. Seedra, Electabuzz, Esper. It's going down. I'm yelling timber, Corfish. Timber, again into a Rapid Strike Urshifru VMAX! Let's go! Fantastic! Look at this beaut. Gale Thrust. If this Pokemon moved from your bench to your active spot this turn, it does 120 more damage. Hello, beautiful. Definitely need to get you into a sleeve. Fan freaking tastic. And there we go, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. Our first big pull of the evening from this box. Fantastic, because I already have the promo Urshifu Rapid Strike that'll just evolve right into that. A little Evolution Incense, never hurt nobody. Get after it. Ooh. Will we strike double fire? Will we strike double fire? Lightning energy. Tower of Darkness. Karina's Focus. Harkle. Timber. Tapig. Glamyow. Silicobra. Frillish. Escape Rope into a Colossal for our hollow hit. Very nice. Not a bad way to end the opening. But obviously this Urshifru VMAX is the star of the show. Look at him in all of his glory. Fantastic. So if you guys did enjoy the video, a like is very much appreciated. Go ahead and subscribe if you're new here. Go ahead and comment down below too. Um, what's, your two, uh, what's your favorite version of Urshifru is? If you're uh, on Team Single Strike or Team Rapid Strike, I would like to know. Personally, I think Rapid Strike is a little cooler. Just because I like blue more than red, and I think the Rapid Strike energy looks dope. But, uh, you know, to each their own. Hopefully you guys are having fun pulling these packs. Let me know what your hits are, because I always like to know. And uh, until next time, have a good one.